My name is Junko Mori. I'm living in North Wales. I've been a metal worker last 24 years. I'm originally from Japan and I studied 3D design in Tokyo and after graduation I didn't feel like a professional artist. So I became a welder and then I earned and learned most of the skill and money to come over to London and study. My inspirations come from how natural form grows. When I was little, I used to have a microscope and I saw little bacteria is dividing and it started growing in front of me. It was an amazing experience. When I'm making things, I don't design first. So I just add on the units I created and then ended up something natural. This probably so far the largest in volume silver piece I ever made, which is a silver lichen cloud. I've been kind of dreaming about if I could make really large silver piece, but somehow it's not too heavy. And then I was watching Sky in North Wales, just around in the garden. And then I thought, oh, that would be really beautiful if I could create a very thin disc. And then if I pierce through each component and I can almost see through the object, people think this is almost over half a meter diameter object is actually quite heavy, but it's not. It's actually, you can lift it to one hand easily. So that was my ambition to create light and but big piece. How I made it is basically, I melt tiny silver from silver grain and then hammer down so it's very, very thin silver and then punch through each disc to almost like a mesh structure. Then TIG weld one by one on the edge from inside. The main challenge of this making process was sheer volume of the piece and then the beginning is not too bad and then the, the volume increase, the area I can access to is get smaller and smaller. So that was a challenge also. The thinness of the material is easily get melted away. So that was a very tense process. A metal is actually really spontaneous once you do a pry right technique, like heat up and then bend and then cool down, that's instant. I always get inspiration from antique silver or almost like ancient objects is always inspires me because I always love hands-on process rather than machine making process. I feel really great honor to be shown alongside with this masterpiece. So yeah, great honor. <laughs>